Electric assisted bikes, they're growing in popularity, but for some, the cost to own one of these is really the biggest mm -hmm. obstacle. But soon, a new state program could help you get a big discount on one. Brett Hoffman, live now in St. Paul to explain. Brett. Yeah, Leah, well, if you haven't already, now is the time to get that bike out of storage and bring it out for a ride. It's a beautiful night here at the Como Lakeside Pavilion. We've seen a few people riding by, and if you've never ridden or heard of an e-bike, well, a new state program hopes to change that. It's time to ride, and you may start to notice more e-bikes on these trails. They can just go a lot farther, faster. Inside Angry Catfish Bicycle in Minneapolis, Andy Tesh tells me, of course, you'll find your more traditional styles here, but also plenty of new electric assisted bikes that give you a boost while you pedal. Each year, more and more people are just kind of discovering the benefits of them. I think when they first came out, I was kind of like, oh, those aren't real bikes. He and other store owners are now preparing for the new e-bike rebate passed by the state last year. We've already gotten a lot of questions over the last several months. The rebates are limited to $2 million a year for 2024 and 2025. So that means accepted applicants can buy an e-bike worth up to $1,500 for 50 to 75% off, depending on your income. In reality, states that have seen success with this tend to expand the programs over time. That's Michael Wojcik, the executive director of the Bicycle Alliance of Minnesota. And he says there is one major barrier to owning an e-bike. Typically, to get a quality e-bike, you're starting out between $1,000 and $2,000. And that can be a hurdle for a lot of people. That's why he hopes this allows more people to try out these bikes that have top speeds between 20 and 28 miles per hour. E-bikes are the kind of tool that really makes bicycling accessible to almost everybody. As one of the stores planning to be included in this program, Tash is looking forward to the e-bike rush. I think people are, are waiting and ready for that application process to start. And if you want to apply for this program, circle June 5th at 11 a.m. on your calendar. That's the day that you can apply. And Michael expects these spots to fill up very quickly, so you better get on it real quick. Uh, and for all the information on this e-bike program, we posted a link on our website at ksdp.com. Live in St. Paul, Brett Hoffland, 5 Eyewitness News. All right, Brett, thank you.